everyone so in this video we will be going through the exercises for chapter 3 for the book digital image processing by Gonzalez and Woods so I have the physical copy here and I have the PDF also but there's some difference in both of them and I will mention uh, when that comes so starting with the first question so give a single intensity transformation function for spreading the intensities of an image so the lowest intensity is 0 and the highest is L minus 1 so first of all let's make sure that we understand what's given in the question so we need to give an intensity uh, transformation function right yeah single intensity transformation function basically it is it is of the form s is equals to t of r now the criteria is that r it represents the pixels of the input image they are anywhere between 0 to 255 but let's say they are um, from 10 up to 200 so now what we need to do is we need to make a transform such that the original image it has the lowest pixel as 10 the highest as 25 so in the transformation it should spread out so the transformation sh should spread these pixels out such that the lowest is 0 and the highest is 255 and in this case basically I'm taking um, like uh, an example of an 8-bit image which is generally the case but we can generalize it like from 0 to L minus 1 we have to stretch a given input into this range now how will we do that well just just take any random values let's say if the pixels we have are 1 19 uh, any any <laughs> it's just random um, 9 89 91 let's say these are the five pixels that we have so the lowest is one and the highest is 91 and now we need to make a transformation such that the output range the range of the output image is from 0 to l minus 1 so how how will we do that well first of all we need to bring this in the range of 0 to 1 because if any distribution is from this range 0 to 1 then we just need to multiply it by the highest value into L minus 1 and we will get the range of this um, distribution as 0 to L minus 1 so we need to bring this in, in the interval of 0 to 1 and then multiply by L minus 1 and how will we do that well the first thing is we need 0 here and how will we bring 0 we need to minus it subtract the lowest number so i will also i will write the formula here and then i will show like how it works for the example so first thing is subtract the lowest one and let's say this these are all the x's so the lowest is x min in this case it is one so we will subtract one from everyone so 0 18 8 88 and 90 so the formula for this one is well what we need to do is we just need to r minus 1 uh, 1 is not general so it should be r minus x min like this now once we have this we need to divide it by 90 let's say what will happen so if we divide by 90 so now this is so this will be 0 this one will be 0 and this will be somewhere between 0 to 1 and this one is the highest number it is 1 and how did we select like 90 well 90 is the highest number after we perform the first operation all right so now I will write this in formula so we need to divide it by 90 and what was 90 it was let's say the highest number minus 1 and 1 was the lowest number so it will x max minus x min and once we have this range we just need to multiply it by l minus 1 because this is uh, normalized so this is from 0 to 1 and now we just need to multiply this by l minus 1 
So here we have our transformation function, right? So the final answer would be S is equals to R minus X min divided by X max minus X min into L minus one. So this is our final answer.